Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. What up, Fight World? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button, also subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang gang, notification gang, please hit the bell icon. Shout out to the Super Chat channel donations, the Venmo, and the Patreon family. You know we work. Now, Golden Boy is set to link up and meet with Mikey Garcia to discuss the parameters of possibly making a fight with one of their fighters, Jorge Linares, champion versus Mikey Garcia, who's basically a free agent, if I'm not mistaken. So he can, he's not obligated to any one thing per se, right? And a couple of days ago, Golden Boy president, Eric Gomez, he tweeted out to Mikey Garcia, mentioned him, at Mikey Garcia, if you're serious about wanting to fight Jorge Linares, call me. No options, no extra fights, straight up, hashtag no excuses. Mikey Garcia rebuttaled, he laughed. He says, LOL, no need to put it out public. You also have my number, LOL. Call you later, bro. So Mikey Garcia is like, you could have, instead of tweeting this, you could have just text me or hit me up directly. This is not really, <clears throat> you know what I mean? Negotiations don't have to be a public deal. So maybe that was for show or, or that's what he felt, but they're, they're about to meet up to discuss the prospects of this fight. I, for one, think it's a very good fight. I was concerned in terms of what Mikey Garcia's next move would be because he was talking about fighting Cotto at 54. I don't think that would have been the greatest choice. I mean, if he won, obviously. But um, that's just a lot of weight to move up. You're a champion at lightweight. <laughs> so I just, I didn't really understand it. But, hey, it's not my career. But I like Mikey Garcia. Methodical. He's come back with vigor ever since his... Um, legal trouble where he was on the sidelines for that two and a half years and he looks like he wants to fight good names so i think he's just trying to hear out all the offers and he's enjoying this free agency he could stay with like on the showtime which his last two fights were on like showtime and fight maybe a robert easter jr in the unification he can also meet up with golden boy hear what they're talking about and possibly go to hbo i think if they had the jorge Linares fight i think he would probably go back to hbo that's where Golden Boy has staged most of their fights, right? Some on ESPN, but bigger fights that I've seen have been on HBO or HBO pay-per-view. So I like it. I mean, these are good, healthy dialogues. I think Mikey Garcia, he, he's he's probably, I think lightweight. I think he he can do more at lightweight. If he can make the weight, fine. I think he could do more and then pursue the 140s, maybe even 147 and fight like the Terrence Crawford, Danny Garcia's and stuff like that. But I think um, Dejan Zlatishanin, no disrespect to him, he was a champion. That was a solid win, I was at that fight. But there's there's some better names there. Jorge Linares being one of them, Robert Easter, things like that. So I would say probably do, coming off the Broner win, do a little bit more at lightweight, and then, you know what I mean, build up your profile like you've been doing and racking up victories or trying to. And then pursue like big name fights, Crawford, something like that. Let me know what you guys think. I like the Lenatas fight a lot. Lenatas, he he had a tough fight with Campbell, but he etched it out in my opinion. And Campbell had a good account of himself, so I think he can he'll be back. And you got to keep in mind, Campbell's like a gold medalist, so um, it's supposed to be a tough fight. But Lenatas, being a veteran, he he pulled it out and did what he had to do to start and close strong in that particular fight so i would love to see a fight with mike garcia let me know your thoughts drop it in the comment section make sure you smash the like button as always hate comment and subscribe till next video is ego signing off so if you enjoyed this video and want more content like this on the channel you can show your appreciation by going to the paypal donate button or the youtube support button and you can donate any amount that you feel is equivalent to the value of this video much more to come thank you guys for your support boxing ego the future of boxing.